classic rock and country music facts and trivia. Appreciate you being here. Today's video is on five classic and most memorable rock and roll feuds. Let's take a look. We're going to start with Lennon and McCartney. Uh, Lennon and McCartney partnership symbolizes the Beatles, but their discord was equally legendary. While fans scrutinize every lyric for clues of their fractured friendship, many don't realize that solo songs like How Do You Sleep and Too Many People were veiled jabs at each other. Their passive-aggressive feud permeated their solo careers, forming a compelling undercurrent to Rock's most famous split. Pink Floyd, Dave Gilmore, and Roger Waters. Pink Floyd's transcendental uh, journey through the 70s and 80s hit a rough patch when Roger Waters declared his exit. Waters eventually legally contested the band's right to perform under the name Pink Floyd and the use of iconic stage props like his inflatable pig. Waters famously told Rolling Stone, it's my pig, it's my plane crashing, after a courtroom drama. Uh, the, side, uh, the law sided with David Gilmore and the band. The frost between the two thawed only in 2005 when Waters finally rejoined the band for a single performance. <clears throat> the Kinks, Ray versus uh, Dave Davies. A, t a temptuous uh, relationship between brothers Ray and Dave not only fueled the Kinks' creative drive, but also led to the band from touring the U.S. While fans may know about their onstage brawls, few are aware that Dave once slashed Ray's speaker cones with a razor uh, just before a live show. And this details paints a vivid picture of the tension that shaped their crazy careers. Uh, Guns N' Roses, Axel and Slash. When it comes to protracted rock feuds, Axel Rose and Slash of Guns N' Roses set the bar. While many fans know of the year-long silence between the two, it's less commonly known that they even communicated through their lawyers while still in the same band. So legal intervention within the band dynamics epitomizes their deep-seated rift and adds another layer to their already complex legacy. And Fleetwood Mac, Lindsey Buckingham, and Stevie Nicks. The, the tempestuous uh, love affair between Lindsey Buckingham and Stevie Nicks was the stuff of rock and roll legend. Their animosity played out on stage and in the studio, <clears throat> most notably in songs like Go Your Own Way and Silver Springs. Few people know that this led to Buckingham's eventual firing from the band in 2018, more than four decades after the ill-fated romance ignited Fleetwood Mac's most successful era. I just, when you're in a band together and you're there a long time, there's going to have tempers, and, and that's just how it is. I mean, not everybody clicks. What makes it worse is like the last one there when Stevie Nicks and Buckingham you also don't mix business with pleasure, if you know what I'm talking about, and expect it to come out good, because it's never going to do. It just never does. Anyway, that's all I have for you. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Please don't forget about Classic TV Facts and Trivia. Head on over there. Check it out. Please subscribe. Have a great day. God bless you. I'll be praying for you.